Hello all my house hunters out there. Eve Brock here and I am coming to you live with our latest listing. This is 846 Dermot Avenue and this one is such a cool house. I cannot wait till you watch this video. So it is on a half of an acre which is totally super manicured. It's got these cool little curbings. It's got all the trees and stuff have been super well maintained and my favorite purple bush out there. Oh my gosh, you guys are gonna love this. It has a one car garage with a screen and then they have a little mural painted on it. And then they added this really neat carport with the ceiling that matches the ceiling on the porch. So it's got a lot of really neat stuff to it. Like your um, hurricane shutters have just been recently added. These are super expensive. These are on every single window and door except for this guy. Um, the door is super cool. It was uh, hand stained. It's got an oil rub bronze handle on it. And it's one of those speakeasy doors. So when somebody comes to the front door, you can be like, hey, no, I don't want any Avon or whatever. Pretty neat, huh? So inside is got not a lick of carpet in it. It's got this really cool Chicago brick, uh, brick fireplace. And the bricks are really inset deep. So it gives it a lot of really neat old character. It's like this house has been here forever. It's got a wood-burning fireplace with a heat elator, which will blow the heat out in the wintertime. And then it's got a cedar-lined wall with cedar beams. And this is super cool. They've upgraded the doors to these nice cottage-style looking doors. So they're not the old ones. Um, the kitchen is not new kitchen, but there's a lot of really cool stuff in it. Like all the appliances have been upgraded. It's got a porcelain style deep sink. And then it overlooks out here where you could put a little outdoor kitchen. There's under cabinet lighting. All right, let's go check out the master. So the master is really a good size. There isn't any furniture in here right now, so it probably looks smaller than what it is but it's really, really nice. The uh, blinds are an upgraded blind. It's a plantation style shutter. So as far as these kind of blinds go, these are some of the more expensive ones. Now the bathrooms have both been updated professionally. We've got a new floor, these really cool glass seamless doors. I like how they put the faucet here so you don't have to get all wet. My tile is really cool. And then these are a, a level two cabinet with the soft closed drawers and then a really nice top. Isn't that pretty? Okay, so moving along. The second bedroom is at the front of the house and it's good size too. It's got upgraded trim got nice views out the windows all right and then it's listed as a two bedroom but it could very very easily be a th three bedroom she's actually using it as such um, right here and then they kind of got these little armoires here for clothes but this also could be a multi-family you know it could be a family room it could be a game room you know, whatever. It's got air conditioning that's been ran out here. This was a porch that's been uh, changed into, it's all under roof. It's been changed into living area. Okay, so in the back, we've got a really nice run for the puppies. We've got gutter back here, really super nice grass and irrigation. The roof is a metal roof. Um, this thing should last you a very, very long time. The septic system is over on this side of the house, so no worries about somebody parking on top of it. 
And then the shed out back here was actually a stick built shed. And then they also brought in the second shed here. So that's a really, really good size. It's got um, uh, power out there and shelves and all kinds of stuff. This is the little area I said would make a nice outdoor kitchen. You can put one of those little gazebos here and that would be fantastic. It's got power. The air conditioning system is about 10 years old. Now we are on central water and placid lakes here, but she wanted it to be super, super uh, filtered. So she went ahead and put Culligan on top of that. This is a multi-zone irrigation system you're seeing there. Here's another view of this side of the yard. Most of the concrete all has some kind of design and paint on it. Those curbings even come back all the way out here. Okay, well that pretty much sums up this house. Um, if you have any questions, you can reach me at Eve Brock's Florida Realty. Uh, number is 863-446-0908. Thanks so much for watching.